fractured leghorn isn't bad, but it's not exactly my favourite foghorn leghorn cartoon, which is a surprise because it's got a cat in it, and I do love animated cats. This is a Warner Brothers cartoon from 1950, directed by Robert McKimson, written by Warren Foster, with voices provided by Mel Blanc. And by voice, I mean foghorn leghorn, who just constantly talks over any attempt the cat might have made to speak. And they're both fighting over a worm because the cat wants the worm to fish, which makes sense. And foghorn leghorn wants to eat the worm. And the big question is, will either of them get the worm? I won't answer that. The worm looks adorable. I love the design of the worm. I think his little face is very cute. That certainly worked very well. With regards to the actual events, though, I didn't really care much for it. I liked the bit where Foghorn Leghorn drew the line to half the worm. That, I think, played out really nicely. That worked very well as a joke or a you know, series of jokes. But other than that, it was just a bit, a bit flat, a bit repetitive and not that interesting. It wasn't terrible. Oh, the bit with the exhaust pipe. I thought that worked quite well. But beyond those two things, those specific things, there wasn't very much to excite me. I did like the character of the cat. It may not be my favourite animated cat, and I wish it wasn't as passive, but that is part of the joke of Foghorn constantly speaking over any attempt this cat might have made. So I get it. I get why that was done, but it's fine. It's not a bad cartoon. It's well animated. The pacing is quite good. As I said, not everything that happens is that interesting, but nothing's bad. Nothing feels out of place. Nothing feels too forced. So... I guess it's it's all right. I'd say watch it once if you're a fan of Foghorn Leghorn. Personally, I would say once is enough. It was okay. Can't imagine I'd watch it a second time.